Hello, this is H.G. Bailey, and welcome back to Let's Play Paper Mario! Last time, we beat the Antigai unit, so we can get through over here and get some treasure. Yeah, defeating the Antigai unit isn't really worth it. All you gotta do is get like five questions right, I think, and you can get through without fighting them, but, well, I wanted to do it for the challenge there, so I had to time all my block. Well, not all of them, but most of my blocks just right. But anyway, hmm, an item up there, but I can't jump that high. Whatever shall we do? Well, if you go up here... Ha-ha! Yeah, we're gonna want that for later. Not that it's really necessary, but... Well, it's there. But anyway, now we want to be a little careful with this part, because I don't want them to hit me with their magic. Although, I do have Chill Out, the, the badge. So, I should be able to... Do fine. I mean, I'd have to fight them, but at least they wouldn't get a first strike on me. But now we can just sneak past them easily enough like this. All right. One nice thing about Lock Lester, well, he can't climb those big stairs. But if I can get through this doorway, he can go down the half stairs really quickly, which unfortunately I can't spin dash through. So, oh well. Haha. -ha. Well, thanks for running right into me. That makes life a lot easier. I don't know if we have to rescue these guys, but we might as well. I do want to rest up here. Hey, Prinny, what are you doing here? Dude! Oh, well, yeah, I like the place too. Mmm, delicious ice treats. Good to see you too. Oh, okay. Nope. They're all dead. It's up to you to save the Mushroom Kingdom. Peach needs you. Or me. I, I could do the job too. However the military recruitment ads go. I don't know. Never been in the military. Yeah, I, I know that's a real shock to you viewers. I'm an engineer, not a soldier. Maybe we should hire Bowser security to take care of Peach. Seems like he would be fine doing that. You know, he gets to hang around Peach all the time and he doesn't have to capture her or anything. And we could all just get along. But I do want to rest up here because unlike heart blocks, resting up at an inn will restore my star power. And I've been using a lot of it. I suppose I could have just not fought the anti-guy unit. Well, with the right badge set up, I think so. Well, anyway, let's get out of here. Well, I'm surprised I got in the door, like, without the camera panning all the way around. But, all right. So, once we get to the top here, uh, we want to go left first, because, well, there's a treasure we can get over there. Not that it's that critical, but might as well show it off. So, anyway, what we got to do here... Let's see. Now, I can't bump attack the dry bones, unfortunately. So, well, well, I might as well show it now. Um, you hit the switch, boost those things up, but, yeah, it's a time delay thing. So we need Bombette to help us out. Whoa. Haha. -ha. A little surprised I was able to get through that easily enough. But anyway, careful. Okay, don't go too far over. And then Bombette, work your magic. Well, I mean, bombs are kind of magical in a way. Anyway, yeah, for doing all that. Haha! -ha. Well, we might need that since I have the HP and the levels to use it with. And let's see. Can I do that again? Get back? Haha! -ha. Alright! Yeah, I can't jump that without Bombette's help there. So, yeah, I don't need to uh, fight you guys again. Losers! But anyway, what's with these symbols on the wall there? I don't know. Maybe it's just decoration, Bowser. I don't know. But anyway, these guys, I can bump attack into. Unfortunately, I forgot to save keys to open doors, so we're going to have to find another one. Oh, well. But easy enough. Maybe if I had the fairy spell, I could get through them, but no, that's, that's another game. Whoa! Forgot about that guy. Okay, let's see. Ha-ha! Easy enough. 
Oh, yeah, they kind of trick you by putting this block all the way in the ground there. Fortunately, just like Bomberman, I can time my explosives and move on relatively quickly. So, all right, easy enough. Let's uh, bring the lock luster back. Spike. But anyway, if we, uh, yeah, just do that. Yeah, they kind of trick you by uh, also, well, maybe not trick you, but give you a hint by not extending the carpet over those two blocks there. But anyway, now we can use keys to open doors. So, let's see what we got coming up here. Let's see, now we got these torches. Up, down, down, up, down, up. And that is a clue to get through to the next part, viewers. So yeah, we gotta go through these exits, up, down, like that, as they were telling us. When I was your age, you had Super Mario Brothers 1. And if you wanted to figure out whether you were supposed to go up, down, left, back, and forth through one of the castles, well, you had to get up off your ass and use trial and error to get through all that. And you'd be lucky if you could figure it out before you ran out of time and died. And we liked it! Fortunately, though, we knew how to get infinite lives with uh, one of those Koopa Troopas or whatever they're called. But anyway, yeah, um, yeah, just go through this. Easy enough. Bump right into them. How many coins do I got? Okay, yeah, we're not gonna hit max. Oh well. That's okay. I'm not really uh, that OCD about it. I just really would rather it not be 998. That would make me very upset. But anyway, well, well, I guess I didn't really need to do that, but I could have. So, oh, hey, Peach, what are you doing here? Oh, well, you're welcome. Always on duty for booty. Oh, yeah, I suppose. Uh, your safety's top priority. We can worry about Bowser later. Okay, let's do it. Let's get out of here. Uh, Peach, can you keep up with me, please? Peach, what the? Smell a rat. Rat burger? No. I don't think you could make a rat burger in real life. I don't think I'd want to. Well, but anyway, well, let's see what else I can uh, do to him, her, whatever. Ha uh ha. -huh. Well, well, I let's see. Let's try Bombette. I don't think anyone else can uh, hurt her. Ha uh ha. -huh. Dumbass. Whoa. Well, yeah, I can take these guys out easily enough. That's why I got the uh, Mega Quake badge with two uh, power-ups. Or, well, I had uh, a power-up and an all-or-nothing, but same difference. I'm always nervous when I'm doing this one. Ha-ha! Whew. Barely have enough reaction speed to do that. But good enough. Barely counts, almost doesn't. Except with atomic bombs. Can't hug our children with nuclear arms. But anyway, yeah, we uh, get back here. I want to heal up and change my badge setup. So, uh, Lock of Lester, if you would just take me to the other side, break on through to the other side. No, he can't do that. But I do want to change my badges. Okay, let's see. Let's get rid of Mega Quake, Bump Attack, Chill Out, Power Plus. Let's see. We want Shrink Stomp. D Down Jump is good. Quick Change, Dodge Master. Let's use Deep Focus for a little filler. I'm never going to use it, but whatever. Get those. Get as much defense as I can. And a Spike Shield. All right. Easy enough. Oh, I should have put brought out uh, Goomba Aria. Well, whatever. I got Quick Change. Yeah, that's what Tiamat said, too. But uh, didn't end well for her, did it? Hmm? What do you mean? Who are these guys? You got the Ninja Turtles on your side? I wonder what would happen if Yoshi would eat a uh, black Koopa Troopa. I don't know. Maybe he does it in other games. I mean, the other ones I saw in Mario World, but... 
Uh oh. I'm thirsty for more. Maybe if Yoshi ate a black Koopa Troopa, he'd become like a black Chocobo and run really fast. Maybe not. Well then, how did you learn how to do that? No pain, no gain, I guess. Sergeant the Master Sergeant's Extreme! No. No, that's another game. Oh, no. Not that music. Not again! Uh, of course it is. Junior Troopa! Nuts. Well, I don't think we have a score to settle. I'm winning like five to nothing. For boss time against Junior Troopa again. Well, I think it's going to be me again, but, well, let's do the best we can. Between Chill Out and all these defensive badges I got, I should be able to just barely be able to block all the damage he can deal to me. But we'll see. I don't know. Sometimes I uh, screw up or something. Okay, so, let's see. Let's go Kumbario so we can uh, tattle him. See what kind of attack power he's got. Oh. Yeah, eight attack power, well, five now, and I can block the rest. But two defense? Well, that's why we gotta have D-Down Jump to get through all that. So, do the best we can. Give the man an A for effort. Oh, well, I would guess he flew here, but okay. But yeah, uh, in his first form, yeah, all he's gonna do is just jump on you like that. And that's eight attack power, and if you time the blocks right, you should be able to uh, block all the damage with this setup here. So, uh, let's see. You know what? Let's uh, bring in Watt. Yeah, Cooper, Bombette, and uh, who is it? Uh, Sushi could deal five damage as well, but they would have to spend FP to get the job done. So, let's see. Now, when he gets down to 38 HP, he goes into his next phase. So, let's not do that. I mean, I would deal exactly 11 damage. So, let's just keep on going like this. If I could have gotten Shrink on him, that would have been nice, but not necessary. Alright, good enough. Um, okay, so let's go Shrink Stomp. If I can do that, that would help. Okay, good. If I didn't get Shrink Stomp on him before moving into the second phase, I would have brought in uh, Sushi to use Water Block. But now I don't need that, at least not for a while, anyway. Watch out for his, uh, chill out, too. Unlimited power! But yeah, in the second phase, he can deal nine damage, not just eight. So, well, first things first, we gotta chill him out. Again, because that wore off. So I can't shrink stomp him, so now I'm gonna need the water block. And that'll give me just enough defense to still nerf him down to nothing. Okay, so, Sushi, work your magic. Hopefully I can time this good. Hey, hey, all right. So yeah, depending on the number of timings you do right, you get another turn of the water block for one more defense. Hey, hey, all right. Okay, so, let's, uh, well, just keep on going, then. I don't need to shrink stomp him anymore, so we'll just go with a good D-down jump with the spike shield so we can get through all that. And, let's see, let's go back to Watt now. We don't need you to maintain the water block. Keep an eye on his chill out. All right, so far so good. Let's go, hmm, I got two turns left? Yeah, we'll be fine. Alright, good enough there. And let's do that too. Alright, got it. Now this is the hard part to go flawless. See what I can do. Maybe he'll heal himself instead. Hey, hey, alright. I'm surprised I was able to block that correctly. Okay, so I can deal 11 damage. That's not enough. So, hmm, let's try a Shrink Stomp if I can. 
Nope. Oh, well. Well, I'm still good anyway. I'm surprised I blocked that lightning bolt, because that's the hardest attack to block. At least for me, anyway. Aw, oh, man. Um, yeah, so both chill out and the water block go away at the same time. Uh, this is gonna be close, folks. I really hope I can get this right. I don't want to have to re-record again. Okay, let's see. Let's go sushi. We need to get another uh, water block going. All right. Sounds good. Awesome. Please no lightning. Hey, hey, all right. I'm, yeah, I'm really surprised that I'm blocking that correctly. The other attacks are much easier to, for me to block, but uh, well, not that one. Okay, what? Yeah, we're going to need your help. Watch out for the water block there. Okay, one more. Yes! Yes! All right! Woohoo! I got it. Flawless victory! Yeah, I had to re-record a couple times to uh, get that one, but it was totally worth it! <laughs> All right. <laughs> it's like, uh, I don't want to have to deal with you. I can't even touch you. Uh, yeah, okay. Couldn't you just... I don't know, sit there on your ass and not let me go through? Yeah, pretty much. What do you mean? Why not? Oh, well, you don't know that I can break the star rod, but other than that... Okay, yeah, let's just keep on going then. And Black Lester, can you help me get up these stairs a little more quickly? That would be nice. Awesome. Well, let's see where this leads. Oh, hey, it's looking a little familiar here. Well, anyway, one thing I can do with what? Get a hidden treasure. Remember this save point here because I'm going to come back here off screen to save, but uh, not right now. We're doing okay. And wait a minute, is this the one? Yeah, I think this is the right door. I think. Yes, yes, okay. Well, if we go in here, what do we got? Hey, how's it going? Oh, hey. Sweet! Oh, you're welcome. Oh, huh? sure, why not? Uh, I don't believe you, but we're going to anyway. Yeah, I want to get my star power back so I can keep using chill out. All right, so got that, and let's see, let's bring Lackaluster back. Now, there is one more treasure that we can still get around here. If there are other hidden treasures that I am unaware of, let me know, viewers, but I think this will be the last one. And it, we've actually already seen it, but we need to uh, come back here as Mario in order to get it. So anyway, let's see, how are we doing on uh, I, I, inventory space? Let's see. Uh, I think I've got room for it. We should, because we got nine items there. So anyway, you go around here, and, well, Mario can jump on these books, but Peach cannot for some reason. But if you do, go all the way around here. Ha-ha! Awesome! Last treasure in the game. But can we defeat Bowser, rescue Peach, and save the Mushroom Kingdom? Find out next time on Let's Play Paper Mario! This is H.G. Bailey. Signing off. Have a good day.